well, COVID-wise, COVID-wise, I think it, it affects every every one of us. Like uh, we we had to to you know adapt to I think what what, what was a new a new way of, of, of doing boxing, right? Bubbles, testing, uh, no no public in, in, in boxing. So basically, it was more psychological than than work uh, work wise because. I was still showing up every day in the gym. Uh, most of my fighters still were uh, able to train. And um, economically, uh, uh, it hit me a bit too. Like I think every everyone, everybody uh, was hit economically. Uh, but the, the the hardest hit that I that I had in 2020 wasn't uh, wasn't the the. The COVID. The, the hardest hit I had uh, uh, was with one of my father who suffered a, a, an injury in the head and, and had to retire after that. Uh, but if I put the good things and the bad things, I have to say that 2020 was an even year. But the, if it wasn't happened that to my father, it would be a really good year. But sadly, uh, that, that's the only thing that really affects me. The, 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 the world and the world begin is been changing, changing. So uh, humans need to adapt, and, I, and I'm 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 like uh, I've been almost in, in in I don't know 30 countries, maybe 35 countries, uh, and and I see different realities and, and people how people is able to adapt, and and that opened my head a lot about how we adapt as human beings. So when you get to understand that, it's easy to get into a fighter's head, you know. Uh, fighters usually are strong, strong, strong people. Uh, you have some fragile guys, uh, uh, but uh, everything is fixable from here, you know. I always say that, that the only thing that can really break a fighter is his head. He's his, his own best friend of his own enemy, you know. And and the, the best way that, that, that I, I, I show them uh, uh, is supporting them, you know, uh, being in the gym every day for them, uh, training hard every day. That's, that's uh, what we do. We train hard every single day, with a de fight date or without a fight date. Uh, we are always ready. Uh, if they call us tomorrow, we are ready. If they call us in a week, we are ready. And I think that's one of the keys uh, uh, for this pandemic. Uh, no, 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 don't have time to think, you know, about it. Okay, if there was a word that you could describe 2020 for you. Uh, even. You know, it's been an even year, no, no good, no bad. I, I have to say, even. When you take everything that happened last year for you and the fighters that you work for and all the work you did for this gym, how do you see 2021 playing out for you and how everything's gonna go with boxing for the sport? No, hopefully places are starting to, to open again. Uh, uh, boxing events are having some people uh, uh, fans, you know, and fighters are artists. They like to perform for the people. And, and I, I see 2020 uh, um, opening again, boxing, having fans in the arena. For me personally, I, I, I hope I have a lot of fights uh, with my with my guys. And and, and I, I just want to work. I see 2021 with a lot of work. <laughs> 